talk of European funding for Wales can often seem abstract. Lines on graphs, figures in reports. But here in Ceredigion, West Wales, the real, the tangible impact of European investment in our communities and in our people can be seen all around us. I'm standing in the shell of what will become the Aberystwyth Innovation and Enterprise Campus. When it launches next year, this £40.5 million facility will bring together food and drink industry experts and academics. It'll grow our local economy and create the high-skill, high-paying jobs our people want and deserve. Now this would not have been possible without a £20 million investment from the EU. The EU allocates money to Member States through its Social and Regional Development Funds. Between 2014 and 2020, Wales will have received over £2 billion from these funds. When the UK leaves the EU, access to them will cease. The aim of EU funding has been to redress economic inequalities between countries and regions. The type of economic imbalances which see our young people in particular having to move away year after year just to find work. This money has paid for training and infrastructure here in Ceredigion. Investment that's so important to sustain the jobs that our communities crave. The UK Government has promised to replace this funding with a UK Shared Prosperity Fund after Brexit. Despite promising to consult on the details before the end of 2018, the Government has so far failed to tell us anything about this fund. We don't know how much money there will be, how the new funding will be shared across the UK, or indeed who will be handling the allocations. Plaid Cymru will keep fighting the UK Government to ensure that Wales does not receive a penny less. It's crucial that we have a say over how and where this money is invested and that the priorities for Wales are decided by people here, not in London. Now the deep structural flaws in the Welsh economy won't be magically solved by just maintaining present EU levels of funding, but we simply cannot afford to proceed from even weaker ground. Plaid Cymru is exploring fresh ideas to boost jobs and wages in Wales, from devolving new taxes such as a passenger duty, VAT and corporation tax, to overhauling our outdated public transport system so that we better connect people with jobs. For our country and communities, we can and must do better. Together, we can build a new Wales.